It's a very sunny day here in Thailand, but that's a good thing because we have solar on our roof. So we embarked on the solar journey mainly because when we were getting our bills for the electric, uh, it was kind of high. Uh, it was over 3,000 baht, so we wanted to cut the cost of those monthly bills down because that wasn't really a, a good way to live. Um, one of the biggest power draws from uh, our electrical system in the home is all from the AC unit. So there's times when we have maybe two to three AC units on at the same time. And uh, each one of those uses about two kilowatts of energy. So we were hitting six, uh, sometimes pushing higher than that. But now we don't have to worry about that as much. It doesn't uh, completely eradicate all of the, the bill, but I'll, I'll take what I can get. So one night we went over to our neighbor's house and we were having drinks, eating food, having a good old time. And we mentioned in passing that, hey, we want to install solar to our home. And the neighbor looks at us and says, mm, I can do that. So our neighbor uh, is an electrical engineer and has his own little business. And anything that has electricity running through it, he deals with it. So whether it be uh, video surveillance, uh, cameras, um, large transformers, uh, industrial kilns, uh, he deals with solar as well. So that was a perfect thing for us. So he said he can get us a good deal. I don't remember exactly what the price is, but I'll throw it right up over here. So that solidified the, uh, the relationship between us and the neighbor. And so he deployed his team. Uh, we actually it was three different teams. One team was the dedicated to the roof. There was another team that was electrical. Uh, and the last team was like pipes and things like that for conduit. The electrical team actually has uh, students because our neighbor also is a lecturer over at the university. So for me, I'm like, hey, that, that's a great opportunity for these students to learn the, the trade, learn the, the field that they want to do for the rest of their life. So at the end of this video, I will cover some of the like main electronic pieces of the solar system. And I will also show some of the Fusion Solar app which uh, I could use to monitor everything that's going on. So without further ado, let's get to the install. Look at 
Ito siya, nakuha niya. Kakiyang na. So this is from Huawei. It's the Sun 2000 solar inverter. It's rated for five kilowatt. If we ever wanted to upgrade and put some additional uh, solar cells on the roof, we would need to swap this out and upgrade it to a 10 kilowatt. So one day in the future, we will be doing that. Uh, over here, uh, this is this box is filled with different uh, circuit breakers and a lot of the protection for both the grid side and for the the solar side but in the middle right over here that is the smart power sensor that's basically a smart smart meter this thing's really nice because it allows me to see a lot of details as far as usage uh, on a daily, weekly, monthly, hourly uh, time setting. So it's very nice. Gives you a better idea of, of the power that's being used compared to the uh, meter that's actually on the pole. And speaking of the pole, we are still tied to the grid. So one of the future projects that we're going to do is any excess energy that we generate from the uh, power cells, we will want to sell that energy back to the power company and get like a credit for it. The first carport that we had was on the low side, so we tore it down and rebuilt it. And in the process, we ripped out all the conduit for the ground wire. So knowing this, the neighbor came back out with his crew, this was months after, and reinstalled the conduit to protect that ground wire, and they did an absolute marvelous job putting this thing back together. So the first thing I'm going to do is open up the Fusion Solar app. This is from Huawei. And once that I'm in, you can see at the top there's a 0.57 kilowatt. That's how much the photovoltaic cells are producing. Clicking on that takes you into a day view so hour by hour it shows you how much energy you're producing. I'm um, producing 2.17 uh, kilowatt hours. Personally, I like to switch over to month view 
and here I can get more of a helicopter 30,000 foot view of, of what's going on month to month. So you can see some months are better than others. Uh, usually that's due to clouds or us just using way, way too much energy. So one danger of having solar is that you tend to turn more things on thinking that you're invincible, but you're not. <laughs> But it, there are also yearly views and lifetime views. So overall, I'm, I'm happy with the solar setup. We have seen a reduction in bills by a third, with some nearing uh, half the cost, which was the original goal. If I wanted to make that even more successful, like I said, we can add more solar cells on the, the roof and uh, upgrade that uh, solar inverter. I hope you have enjoyed this video and thanks so much for watching.